Prince George's fire and police detectives are conducting a joint investigation into a fatal blaze this morning in Upper Marlboro. Firefighters responded to the 1500 block of Buck Lane around 2.15 a.m. It took crews 45 minutes to extinguish the flames outside the structure. They then entered the home to put out leftover hot spots and made a shocking discovery. Rochelle Metzger has the latest from the scene. The early morning fire may be out, but burning questions remain surrounding a body discovered among the charred debris of this abandoned home on Buck Lane. Fire investigators have concluded their on scene uh, portion of the investigation. They determined that they, they found some evidence that homeless people, vagrants or squatters uh, had been occupying the abandoned home. They don't know for how long and they didn't get into what type of evidence, but they do believe there were some people there living in that house. As you can see, this home is completely gutted with many of the charred remnants laying out here in the front yard. This here was a beam that was once part of the ceiling. Officials believe this fire may have been burning up to an hour before anyone even noticed. Once the firefighters had the fire extinguished, they went inside the home and they found a deceased body. Uh, the body is unrecognizable. It's impossible to tell at this point the, the gender. The investigation is open and ongoing. So they don't know if it was someone just trying to stay warm or if it was intentionally set? At this point, they're not looking at anything suspicious. So we are looking towards an accidental cause of the fire, but it's still necessary uh, to have the autopsy results before we come to a conclusion about what might have caused the fire. We know that some of the neighbors or uh, law enforcement officers in that area said there may have been two people, as many as two people living there, uh, but only one person was found. Can you confirm reports that say this is not the first time there's been a fire at that location? That's true. We were out there earlier in the year for a fire, uh, a significant fire, but it was extinguished and that, that house was boarded up. Now, right across from where all this happened are CSX tracks. Because investigators were working so close by, train traffic was stopped but has since resumed. The body is now with the medical examiner who will be tasked with piecing together the remains to figure out exactly who the victim was and how he died. In Upper Marlboro, I'm Rochelle Metzger, CTV News.